so the next uh, speaker is going to be uh, Leslie. So Leslie, hopefully you're you're ready. Um, Leslie comes to us from Falls Church, VA, just outside Washington, D.C. in the United States. Leslie is a parent, teacher, writer, and musician. She studied at Wesleyan University in Connecticut and at the University of Michigan. Her notable positions include cook at the legendary Del Rio Bar in Ann Arbor, general and editorial assistant at the Smithsonian Folkways Records, and production associate for the Folk Masters concert and radio series. Her first novel, Seeking the Center, is about sort of the multiple meanings of ice hockey. And her second book, Still in Progress, is set on the west coast of Sweden during Viking times. I think by the end of this, we're gonna have quite a lot of book recommendations for us all to read in the ne in, 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 over the next coming uh, coming months. Leslie is a folklorist uh, wannabe and an archeologist wannabe, and uh, is interested also in the traditional identity and cultural expressions of all kinds. And that includes ice hockey. Leslie loves textiles and oral histories, rocks, wildflowers, the ocean, and heading north, which is interesting. I'm not sure what heading north uh, meant, Leslie. I should have checked for you before. Um, and also loves a good groove. So Leslie will read her poem, The Dead, A Stream of Consciousness. So Leslie, when you're ready. Thank you, Zach. Um, just for context, I want to say a couple things about my piece. Uh, I wish that I could make words as instantaneously descriptive as images, which of course they could never be, but words are what I've got. Uh, so you can fill in the blanks. This piece consists of words that I've been experimenting with during the ongoing protests against police brutality following the murder of George Floyd by Minneapolis police. The words are inspired by the righteousness and manifold beauties of the protesters and by their courage, strong against the backdrops of a global pandemic and continuing state-sanctioned, state-sponsored violence against people of color. I want to remember those who've died during this dark time and those who live on hoping and working and fighting for a future time of light. I wish for us to be in solidarity and to share strength with one another. The title of the piece is The Dead, A Stream of Consciousness. A body, a person, a breath, a thought, a gesture, a footprint, a platform, a plot, a story, a yarn, a thread, a tweet, a status, a statement, a judgment, a seat, a lecture, a poem, a painting, a play, an hour, a minute, a decade, a day, a bio, a CV, a profile, a pic, an Insta, an address, a number, a shtick, a club, a cocktail, a dish, a dance, a mission, a vision, a dream, a trance, a hairdo, a piercing, a color, a style, a ribbon, a rainbow, a mask, a smile, a move, a groove, a drumbeat, a lick, a pop song, a playlist, a soundtrack, a flick, a hit, a catch, a toss, a spin, a slide, a jump, a shot, a win, a loss, a gloss, a goal, a glitch, a moonshot, a spaceship, a goddess, a witch a worker, a waiter, a lover, a bloke, a pinch, a sip, a smoke, a joke, a dust up, a quarrel, a quibble, a quark, an atom, an axle, a road trip, a lark, a wing, a wave, a course, a flow, a stutter, a stagger, 
a glissade, a go, a try, a cry, a sickness, a curse, a witness, a rising, a vigil, a verse, a call, a response, an ally, a friend, a placard, a promise, a march, a demand, an arc, a struggle, a portent, a plea, a planet, a people, a fist, a knee. Thank you. Thank you very much. That was, that was uh, wonderful. Thank you very much for doing that. Thanks, Zach. Realize I'm probably clapping on behalf of all 70 plus people. So Leslie, this is a this is a, the most thunderous clap I can do for you. So that was Thank you. <laughs>